What did I do? Is this the world of dreams? I didn't mean to... Huh? Your eyes. Your hair. Could it really be you? Oh. Who are you? Someone who has seen your face in the stars above. I've been looking for you my whole life. You can't see it now, but when I searched the universe, it was your face that I saw. You seem familiar to me too, as if I've known you before, as if you've been in my dreams. But I came unprepared. What do you mean? Your beauty deserves a gift of equal majesty. I will go and find the most beautiful flower in all the world and bring it to you. And then you will see in its petals what you mean to me, the most beautiful flower. Huh? The most beautiful flower in all the world. He saw my face in the stars. No, 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 this is not good. I am the queen. I can't let my weakness prevail. It's time to create Stony. Okay, Flora. You used nature to destroy my creatures. Now it's time for the tables to turn. Everything that is not alive, unite! Take the essence of nature and become her nemesis. Go and destroy Flora. You're perfect. Oh, huh? <gasps> ah! He's about this tall, brown hair. You can't really miss him. He's always talking. Matt is not in Neverland. I sense he's not here. And definitely not shy about telling you how great he is. Or that his ideas are big. Really big. So this guy, Matt, is the one you think can save the world of dreams? We do. He's the one who can turn the Queen back into Tinkerbell. I sense there's a side to Matt that hasn't shown itself yet. Like this flower. Part of him is good and sensitive. But the other part is self-centered and childish. You just need to look deeper. Well, we'll need to find him to know for sure.